Hello everybody, my name is Kaysam and here is a quick video in which I'm going to show you how you can hide your desired Android apps without having to install any app locker or any third party app. Now, I have taken a long while without having to talk about these Android tricks but I've decided to do that for today alongside these virtual DJ tutorials that I do every day. Now let me show you how. I'm using a Techno Spark 3 Professional and I don't know whatever phone you're using but what I'm sure about is that maybe these things vary from phone to phone. Let me show you these two steps. Uh, in my Techno Spark here, the first option I have is to go to my freezer. Uh, most of the phones of these days have these freezers and when, you're, when I simply go there, I, I just choose to uh, add, okay, like add and here it brings the apps that I have to add. Now most of these apps are only third-party apps. Remember, you can't really hide uh, inbuilt apps, okay? Uh, you can only hide these installed apps. For example, I want to hide Zenza, I want to hide YouTube Studio, I want to hide Thunder VPN, and here I want to hide GB WhatsApp. What I simply have to do is tap OK. And it does that for a while. Here are my apps. And when I go back, these apps are no longer here. I don't have YouTube Studio, I don't have Zenza, I don't have all the other apps that I've put inside. Now, this is not yet hidden because someone can just come here and simply open the freezer and see your apps. Now, all you have to do here is being creative. You just have to go somewhere and disable the freezer. This is done by long pressing on the part of the screen that is empty and going to the desktop setting. When you go there, scroll down to other settings. In other settings, you simply disable the freezer. And if you are not able to see your freezer at the first place, this also is a way of enabling your freezer for you to start seeing it. Go to your desktop setting, in, I mean by tapping any open part of your screen and then of course navigating down to other settings. And there you'll have to see the freezer. Okay, when I disable the freezer, you can see the freezer here and also you can see the apps that I hit, okay? Like these apps go away completely. The other way is also very simple. You just have to long press on the empty part of the screen, go to the desktop setting and here it says icon catching. When I come there, I simply choose to add or remove apps. I want to tap that, okay? I really want to select these apps. I want to select YouTube. I want to select Zapier and four in a row. And I simply have to go back. When I do that, the apps are hidden, okay? and that is done but still someone can easily come there in the same way and then open here and can access your apps so you can really choose to make this an encrypted folder by having to set a password in this case i'm going to put a pattern that i can use for locking this this is simple i come to the setting and then enable this set password this will ask you to set a pattern let me draw a quick one here then i confirm it okay so when i do that it's all done uh, uh, all these apps are now hidden when I come back there and check on them I don't see any unless I have to put in a very correct pattern here so when I do that I have no access to these apps but when I draw a correct password or a pattern that is when I am able to do this now that is it guys that's very simple in case there's anything you want me to know or anything you want to add about this video do it down below in the comment section and also I have good hashtags down here please don't forget to check them out and if you're still new to my channel help me and subscribe because i have good content coming your way each and every time see you in the next video